Now, when you look back over the 2013 season, um, what were some of the high points for, for you last season? Uh, we had some good high points. Uh, we were close to meddling at Worlds. Um, we took a fifth there, a couple points away from making it to the semis. Um, we uh, beat some really good teams. Um, had two, made two AVP finals, and uh, we were ranked the number one team on the AVP, so we were very consistent on the AVP, which is great. I feel like we uh, came together as a team really quickly and uh, without an off season, did a lot of good things, and uh, I felt like my blocking really improved um, over the season. So, um, yeah, a lot of things came together. Great. And um, what were some of the challenges? Were there challenging times that you kind of had to fight through? Yeah, um, there are definitely challenging times. Um, you know, we didn't get an off season together, so we didn't get to kind of iron out all of our um, wrinkles. Um, but, uh, you know, and all the teams uh, were competing at a high level, um, so they were pushing us all the time, which I think was good and bad, you know, good because it made us better, and, you know, bad because we took some tough losses. And um, But uh, overall, I'm, I'm happy with the season. Now you got married before the season and uh, played, and he and Andrew Fuller, your husband, is also your coach. Yes. So how does that work? Uh, strangely, it works really well. Um, I don't know if, uh, I think it's all him because <laughs> <laughs> I don't know that I particularly am uh, easy to work with, but um, he's been great and he. I really respect his coaching and what he's doing with us. Um, I'm really excited to see what we do this season. Um, tell us a little bit about your wedding and your honeymoon. Uh, uh, so we got married in February down in San Juan Capistrano um, at a little Spanish restaurant. Um, 140 of our closest family and friends. <laughs> and uh, it was amazing. I am not one of those people who was thinking about my wedding since I was young. Um, it just kind of all came together. and. Uh, Great people, great music, great food, and can't ask for more than that. Super memorable for me. Um, we waited 10 months before we went on our honeymoon uh, in Switzerland, and uh, we ate a lot of cheese, <laughs> made our own fondue, um, rented little uh, cottages along the way, and rented a car, so we drove all across uh, the country to the, you know, the French part, the German part, drove through the Alps, through the Alps. <laughs> we were on a train and it took us through the through Alps. The Alps. Yeah. Like through a tunnel or through when you say yeah. through? Well, we were in our car on a train. Oh, oh, and got it. Okay. The train was zipping. It was kind of scary. Wow. <laughs> it was pitch black. We couldn't see anything. And now you and Andrew are preparing for the next, your coming season, and your new partner is uh, Brooke Sweat. Yes. And uh, how is that going? Uh, Brooke has been great. I uh, have played against her a bunch, so you know, I, <laughs> I kind of knew what I was getting into, but having her on the same side of the court is, with me is really, um, really exciting. She has incredible ball control, and um, she's just a really, really good volleyball player. Um, so I'm really excited to see what we can accomplish uh, in 2014. She was also the EVP Defensive Player of the Year. Right. So, yeah. Now you also have your law degree, and you passed the bar in California, correct? I did. And it was so, like ages ago. <laughs> do you ever feel like you just want to check it all and, and go be a lawyer, or do you are you do you look at the people who are lawyers and say, "Hey, I get to play beach volleyball"? Yeah, I look at the people who are lawyers and I say, "Oh my gosh, I wish I could be a lawyer every day." <laughs> um, no, I'm just kidding. Um, no, I I love what I do, um, and I wouldn't trade that. For a second, but uh, you know, there will be a time when I will suit up and do something, <laughs> whether it be a legal career or you know, being a AD somewhere. I don't know. Who knows what the future holds? <laughs> Great. Well, thanks so much. Thank you.